Surviving 9G, pilot secrets in 60 seconds. If your heart feels like it's stopped, you're not dying. If your vision narrows to tunnel, you're not blind. If your body screams at 9G, you're human. Trained humans survive it. Shock first, humans black out at much lower G, if unprepared. 9G means nine times your body weight pressing down. That makes a 10 pound head feel like 90. Now the truth, surviving 9G is a combo of tech training and timing. Tech, anti-G suits squeeze your legs and abdomen to keep blood in your brain. Aircraft systems manage G buildup and give warnings. Training, pilots learn the AGSM a forceful leg and abdominal pump controlled breathing to keep blood up top. AGSM also uses short pressurized breaths, hook breaths. Physiology, muscle tone hydration conditioning raise your G tolerance. Safety nets. Centrifuge training simulates high G, teaching immediate reactions before real missions. G-lock stands for G-induced loss of consciousness. Recovery takes seconds, vision returns from tunnel to full. Real numbers, with suit and AGSM, many fighter pilots handle 7 to 9 G for short bursts. Unprotected blackouts can happen under 4 to 5 G. Modern jets limit sustained G to protect pilots and airframes. Pilots also preload before the pull to stay ahead of the G. Bottom line, it's not superhuman, it's gear grit and practice. Want a deep dive on AGSM drills? Say the word.